Hey, this is Metal Mike and welcome to my new column called Scream For Me Long Beach. And in this lesson we are going to figure out cool things we can do with natural harmonics found in your guitar. So the most common natural harmonics that almost all guitar players know about can be easily found and gotten out on a 12th, 5th and 7th fret. And a natural harmonic is something that lays on top of the string, something you get out of your guitar but not pressing behind the fret. It's basically like a bell that sits on top of your guitar. So you could easily get your harmonics out of guitar on the 12th, the 7th and the 5th fret, just like this. A good harmonic will sing. Okay, so some of my favorite harmonics happen to be on, on a G string. And it's right in between the frets of two and three. Um, there, there are a ton of cool things you could get out of them. And there are four harmonics that you could get out of. That if you play them correctly and use the whammy bar, you could really get a high-end pitched sound. So here they are picked. Now a common thing you will see many guitar players do is to move the whammy bar down, loosen the string, and as the string comes up, you touch the harmonic, the harmonic screams and you bring it up in pitch. This is a, a sound that Dimebag made very popular, but before him we also had Joe Satriani, Steve Vai, and other guys do before him. So here's a good example for you. Okay, the closer you get to the second fret, the higher the harmonic will scream. So let's get another one, try to go even higher. And if you're really lucky, you could get an even higher one if you play it right next to the second fret. So let me show you a couple cool ways of using harmonics in your licks. One of the cool ways of getting great sounds is using more than one harmonic at a time to create a cool abrasive sound. Uh, one of my favorite things to do is to play a harmonic on a G string 5th fret and a B string 7th fret at the same time. And while those, those two harmonics are ringing, you use a whammy bar to bring the pitch up and down. You'll see Joe Satriani doing that on Surfing with the Alien. Another way I like to do it is sort of like a rapid fire type of playing of harmonic. He, he, he allows, you allow the harmonic to, to come up while pulling off on a string, randomly on, randomly on a string. And again, I use the G string a lot because there's a lot of cool harmonics hiding there. When the harmonic, when the string is going up in pitch, you, you tap the harmonic with your third finger making the harmonics come out clearly. So the, the example might go something like this. So what that is, is a pull off. And while the string is ringing, I, I touch the string, get a harmonic at the same time as I'm hitting the bar. So you get that cool fluctuating sound. So as I'm, as I'm getting the harmonic with my finger, I'm already working the bar. And I go down uh, in, in no particular order sometimes. Another way of getting cool sound is that if, you're, if your tremolo system on, on, your, on your guitar it works properly and you get like a fluctuating sound from a Floyd Rose, you could really hit a harmonic and you basically spring the whammy bar out and, and puts, puts harmonic in a crazy flurry of sound. It will sound something like this. You hear that crazy vibrato and bringing the harmonic out. 